Good morning, I'm going to be making a video today on what one can sow in the month of April. So in a way it would be easier actually to make a video called What Can't You Sow in April? Because there's so much that you can sow at this time of year. The weather is warm, it's nice and still, so let's make the video. Okay, so I have some seed packets here, let's go through them and you can see some great things to sow in April. Right, okay, we have courgettes, cucumbers, squashes and pumpkins. Great vegetables, very versatile. The way I like to germinate them is put them into windowsill propagators and then germinate them inside on a sunny windowsill because that way you're less likely to get your seeds eaten by mice. The next is carrots. Now carrots you can straight sow them outside. You can also grow them in containers as well. I've got two varieties here. Atlas, that's like a globe carrot, great for those who have got stony or clay soil. And Manchester table carrot, a traditional variety. Turnips, a great vegetable. You can straight sow these if you want to. Beetroot, just a very nice vegetable in general. They grow well in containers, all sorts of different varieties and very delicious as well. Radishes, now radishes are brilliant because if you keep sowing them every three weeks, maybe even up until October if the weather is favorable, you can keep getting radishes throughout the year. Great thing to grow, very tasty, great in a salad. Leeks, very, very good. Now the way that I like to germinate leeks is to just get a pot of multi-purpose compost, scatter a load of these on the top, put it inside, put a little bit of compost on the top and then keep it watered, leave it and the chances are they will germinate within two or three weeks and maybe a month or two later you can then plant them out when they're about this big. Chard, a great vegetable to grow. Perpetual keeps coming if you keep picking it. Very ornamental very versatile and just a lovely overall vegetable to have at your allotment or in your backyard. Spinach, lovely vegetable indeed once again. Perpetual, very very tasty and you can use these for many many dishes as well. Peas, now peas are a great thing to grow. You can straight sow these if you want but Quite often birds or mice maybe might nip the tops off of them. So once again, I find to germinate them inside on a sunny window sill is very good. Get them to about that size and then plant them out. Now, for those of you who fancy a touch of the exotic, melons. These are blacktail mountain watermelons. Now, you can sow these at this time of year. I'd recommend you sow them on a sunny window sill in a window sill propagator for the extra temperatures. Melons are good to sow a little bit later if you know if you're if you've got a later warmer season starting because they really really do need the warmth. Now you can also sow your first if you haven't done so already early potatoes or your second early potatoes. Brassicas are great to sow now. You know things like kale, cabbage, cauliflower, calabrese, purple sprouting broccoli. Very very good to sow that now as well. A few weeks ago I sowed these carrots and this is variety Nantes. You can see there, look, they are starting to come up now. Little seedlings here. And down here you can see my Swiss chard that I sowed a few weeks ago. They will be ready for planting out soon. The Komatsuna as well, once again ready for planting out soon. And here I germinated these on a sunny windowsill. So we've got sun gold tomatoes and here we have got courgettes so I germinated these a few weeks ago. Okay people there you go that's what you could sow in April. Any comments questions or whatever's please feel free to post below if you like my work please feel free to like share and subscribe and you can check me out on dan underscore home gardens on Instagram if indeed you are interested. See you next time.